Mr. Ambassador, on Thursday, the whole world heard a shocking news, the news that is, is particularly uh, tormenting for African population that tells the story that many African migrants died on the Italian island of Lampedusa. What's the take of the African Union on this particular tragic situation? Uh, first of all, we, we heard uh, with a great sadness uh, the, this tragedy, which uh, according to the latest uh, report has led to the death of, the, uh, of uh, almost 300 people uh, coming from Africa. Uh, it's a great tragedy and uh, we are really sad and we want to express to the families and the friends of uh, those people our most sincere condolences. The issue here is not about legality or illegality. It is just uh, unhuman what is happening because uh, whatever conditions are there, this should not happen to anybody from anywhere on this uh, earth. So we uh, are looking forward that uh, the entire international community will come together with solutions to stop this kind of tragedy that have been going on for the past decade. Mr. Ambassador, for a long time now, illegal migration from Africa particularly is increasing time after time and there is no sign of stopping uh, this. So what do you think member states should do in order to curb this particular problem of illegal migration that is leading African population to suffer, even uh, lose their lives? M member states should, um, from my point of view, create opportunities for their youth, uh, be it at the political level through inclusion and participation, but also at the social and economic level, with uh, providing them uh, with opportunities that will enable them to uh, get whatever they expect from a society to have a decent life wherever they are from. So member states should uh, look into this matter seriously and uh, find ways of uh, uh, creating opportunities with the resources that we have on the continent. Because these young people that are leaving the continent are depriving the continent from its own manpower, its own uh, human resource. And this is why we at the African Union, uh, as we are developing uh, the Agenda Africa 2063, we are putting emphasis on the need to invest in our people by providing them with not only education, but also with food, with uh, health care, but also with uh, decent living conditions for them on the continent.